If you look at the development in the pastoral areas and the herd composition of pastoralist um, herds, then you see that there is a shift from keeping grazers such as cattle and sheep towards keeping more and more browsers such as goats and camels. Now the reason being that browsers and especially the camel are much more adapted to harsh environments in the arid lands. So, and one of the major reasons why people keep camels more and more is because their ability to convert vegetative matter into animal protein more, much more efficiently than grazers would do that. So what you'll see is animal protein is of course for pastoralist milk and milk contributes mainly to household food security. It contributes camel milk in pastoral communities contributes to between 50 to 60 percent to the nutrient intake of the family. So this is very important. Now if you look at a camel, a camel can produce milk between 10 to 12 months and uh, has a lactation period between 10 to 12 months and it can even go up to 18 months. And they produce between three to seven liters of milk a day. And they do so also during the dry spell or during the drought when a cow has already ceased its production. So milk is still available and that is very important for the pastoralist. And if you would compare a herd of cows and a herd of camels in the same climatic conditions and in the same arid areas, you will realize that a camel herd produces four times more milk than a cow herd will do. So this is important and that's why you see that traditional more cattle keeping communities such as the Maasai or as the Boran communities have shifted now and are diversifying their herds and they're including camels now. And the potential and the tendency for pastoralists in the arid lands to, to move to camel keeping is there. The camel population in sub-Saharan Africa at the moment is around 17 million but it's the only population that is on the increase while other populations such as cattle and sheep is on the decrease. So there you see the tendency of the camel in the sub-Saharan, in sub-Saharan Africa and in the arid lands.